Often Talks with Footprints Counselling Service. I hope I find you well today. Today's talk is about staying current and keeping ourselves up to date with what's going on, even what seems to be going on. If this is your first time watching my video, welcome to my channel. My name is Yinka Bakari and I do inspirational, motivational talks on life issues. Do you subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. On Facebook or on Twitter, I post every Tuesday. We do need to keep ourselves current in the ways we think, the way we eat, in general, the way we live our lives. Even if we look how fast technology with mobile devices have moved over the last 10 stroke 20 years, it's very hard to predict where we will be in the next two years. Most people use their phones to go online, not their pad or even a laptop. This is just one example of many we could talk about. I've got elderly neighbours and they've been telling me about stuff that they've been seeing on Facebook. They may even move up to Snapchat or TikTok. Now I'll know for sure when they do that, times have completely changed. <laughs> but they're good people. If you don't change with the times, you will get left behind. There's absolutely not much doubt about that. Take the advantages of learning something new every day. There's so much you can do and find interesting to find online. And you'll be more interesting to your husband, wife, partner or friends, members of family and even new people that you come across. Because you'll be an interesting person. You'll be able to talk about information that you've gained. Even some of this knowledge could have been found online via your phone, for example. I've even discovered that the Open University has hundreds of free courses, which means you can upgrade your knowledge, start a new job or career, or even start your own business. There are still a good few people that are still using methods they used in 1995 or the early 2000s to solve or work through situations in 2020. I'm not sure how that's going to work. The rules have changed, the game has too. If you are playing a new game with outdated rules, it will be a bad outcome, nine times out of 10, I think. So don't be a hoarder believing you already know enough to carry on through the rest of your life. You really need to keep current. This talk is to help us get out of our comfort zone and learn as much as we can about our life as we will never know enough. Plus, it keeps your mind active and sharp. A little bit of knowledge can go a long, long way. Thank you for listening. If you know anybody that could take some pointers from this talk, do share it with them. Until next week, do take care of yourself. Do your best to stay positive and see what you can learn. Bye for now.